With the regular season approaching, Indiana Volleyball has been grinding through the preseason to get ready for the non-conference slate. But before they fly to Las Vegas for the upcoming weekend, the freshmen currently have a bigger task to tackle, their first day of college. So we're going to our first class right now. <laughs> I'm really excited to learn more about my major, which is interior design. So hopefully the classes towards that are interesting. We've had our share of loud neighbors not knowing how to do the laundry. The first couple of weeks we showered freezing cold because we didn't know how to work that. Yeah, we have it all figured out now though. We're getting there. Yeah. Although the freshmen are on their own, their teammates didn't leave them hanging on the first day of class. Senior Sam Fogg gave each of them note cards detailing tips on how to get around. Yes, she did. She color coded them. Uh, she told us like when we should leave for the bus stop and like everything and like it was so sweet and she came over last night and like helped us with everything and then I got a text from almost everyone on the team saying like happy first day of class and it was really awesome. Uh, I did not get lost actually. She helped me so I, I made it through. Welcome to our first road trip. We are going to Vegas this weekend. I'm with Abigail, freshman here. Um, yeah, we're about to be late, so. Oh my God. <laughs> here, see, you didn't ruin it. Come on, Abs, we're going to be late. Let's go. How excited are you guys for our first road trip to this year? You know, I'm pretty excited. I haven't been to Vegas yet, personally, so this is my first time. Of course, I'm excited to compete, but it'll be nice to sightsee and get to be a tourist for a little bit. I just think it'll be cool to see the sights. Like, it's one of those places that is so unique that even if I never go again, at least I'll get to see anyone once. And we get to see Cirque du Soleil, which oh. I am stoked for. Okay, okay. Sam, you got anything to say? Vegas, oh, baby. <laughs> all the noise and then there's the work okay so you have to right now tomorrow we're playing okay and I don't didn't come here to watch a team go through the motions at any point so you got to give me an hour hour and a half as hard as you can go and then the rest of the day you can relax and enjoy it but uh, we got to learn how to flip the switch between you're having fun and things are cool and wow and great breakfast and all that stuff and we got work to do and a responsibility to to give more than we get okay yeah. everyone got it yeah yes. okay quick cheer let's go all right Woo! I don't want to be easy to play against. That's a big part of what I want us to be heavy to play against. It's a hockey term. It's like when the puck goes in the corner and two guys go in, it's really hard to get the puck away from us. Everyone understand that? Yeah. I talk about it constantly, it's never going away. And when we get really good, Sweet 16 good, Elite 8 good, I'm still gonna say the same thing because it's the difference between winning championships and not. We're definitely very grateful and um, we felt blessed for the opportunity to be in Vegas, have that opportunity and free time to spend with each other and just experience the city. We went to see the Fountain, the Bellagio, and we just walked downtown Vegas, um, got some gelato, went to see Cirque du Soleil, so that was pretty cool too. Um, it's nice like knowing that we have like some free time to like do stuff for ourselves and um, just enjoy Vegas itself because a lot of us haven't been there. But the real reason why we're there is to go 3-0.